every week it's slightly, you know, it's a different story and it throws up a slightly different dilemma. Um, and I have to say that most of the pleasure is the chemistry of, you know, not just the actors, but the whole team, you know. It's very slick. It's, everybody's confident in what they do. Nobody's trying to battle with anybody else. It's just a real pleasure from that point of view. The, the working atmosphere is fantastic. She's very observant, Natalie, I think. She sort of does a lot of picking up what's going on and is quite diplomatic and, and um, sort of, it's quite crucial to her to size people up. She's not the sort of person who just go bludgeoning in. So she's working out, what's this one like? What's this one like? And how do we deal with them? How do we converse with them? Because sometimes we have to get very tough. I, Natalie has to defend the police against the CPS quite often. Um, and she's very loyal to her troops, you know. So she will do battle if she has to. We see Natalie really looking after Ronnie and this new wonderful partnership being created. Yes, I mean, I think what happens there is, you know, there's so much unspoken that we're the two who have got to soldier on with this now two-sided triangle. When Ronnie goes off the rails a bit, there's a lot of, um, you know, tough kindness going on. She's just saying, pull yourself together. She doesn't say, I know it's awful and give him a big hug. Not really. It's, it, there's something else more important that's got to be done. But he's got to look after himself, so go home. And then the new one's got to be brought in and given a, a responsibility and tested out. And, you know, there, there are moments of insecurity about um, Sam. You know, we don't know very much about him. Natalie doesn't know very much about him. There are rumours about him from his last posting, and you sort of wonder about that. And I love that about Paul, because he's got that absolute, I'm not giving anything away, you know, kind of quality. And so it, we as a team, as a police team, are finding out, you know, who is this guy? And with Jamie Bamber moving on, it's freshened it up. Absolutely. I think that's the great thing. You, you feel sad about the person that's gone and sentimental. He went out on a high, didn't he? He went out on a real high, yeah. We, you know, we had we had big Christmas party as well, you know, it was around that time. So we were all sort of in that holiday mood. You've got this new injection of a, a, of a subtly different chemistry. I mean, he's not an opposite type, you know, but, but, he, but he's just got this subtly different chemistry and a very different vocal quality as well from Jamie. And it just, it, it alters, it's like a catalyst. It alters us um, as well as being different to look at. But uh, and, and I just, I've watched some of, you know, um, I've recently just watched his first episode and I just think he's great. Really, really, really great. So you're still having fun? Yeah. <laughs> Make sure of that.